Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm here at Rite Aid. I'm glad to be back. I have bonus cash expiring in a few days, so I need to use it. Um, not as good of a week this week as we had all year long, but there's still deals to make. And I'm really happy because I was able to get the $1.50 off of two sparkling ice coupons from... A coupon fairy over on Instagram. She is all out at the moment, but she may be able to get more. Uh, so you can definitely check her out over on Instagram to see if she updates and if she has those available. All right, so I'm going to go in and put together a transaction based off of what's in stock and what I haven't already done as far as monthly deals go. So if you want to see what I do, stick along. If not, I'll catch you on a better week. <laughs> No, hopefully you stick around and um, I could tell you how I do it and how to make the best of it. So that way I can maybe give you some ideas. Or if you're just learning or starting out or coming back to Rite Aid, this can kind of help you understand some of uh, how things are working here at Rite Aid as far as couponing goes. So go ahead and give the video a thumbs up and let's get into it. I am so excited. They have the Moroccan Argan Oil, which I've been wanting because it just sounds amazing. Plus, Pure Zero is the best shampoo and conditioner so far i found for my hair. So it's still on a monthly deal. I checked to make sure I did not do it on this account. And you can do that by going over to your account and on the website, uh, checking the bonus cash you earned. And you can see everything that you earned and check it there. So I checked to make sure all of July I have not done this deal on this account. So I'm going to go ahead and pick up two of them. They're priced at $9.99. You buy two, you get $10 back. And then there's a $5 back rebate on Ibotta. And you could do it twice. So I'll be getting $10 back there. So that makes these completely free. But I will be using a 5 off of 25 email coupon. I'm going to go ahead and pick up some of that sparkling ice to top this transaction off. Here are the coupons I'm going to be using. It's a $1.50 off of two of the 17 ounce bottles of sparkling ice, any variety. Um, I'm going to go ahead and pick up four. They're buy two, get one free. So I'll be paying for three. I'll get one free. But when you buy four, you get $4 back. So I'll go ahead and grab four. So these are all that are left here. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab these. All right, my favorite cashier is here, so I'm not gonna have any problems using my coupons. That's why I was gonna split my transaction up in the first place, but she will take the coupons with no problem. So I'll be able to get more of the sparkling ice. So to max out that deal, I'm gonna grab nine of them. And then I'm going to add some other items to this transaction. I'm going to use two of the five off of 25s. I have the email one and the Catalina one here. So I'm going to go ahead and um, get over 50 so that I can use those. And I'm going to make sure it's 50 after digital coupons. And I'll show you what else I pick up. So they only had two for six, seven in the refrigerated section. So I'm going to come on down to where they keep the drinks that are not refrigerated. And hopefully they have two more because I won't be able to do the deal if they don't. Okay, oh, here we are. So we found two more and that will top that off. So they're buy two, get one free. So I'm going to be paying for six, but I'm going to get three for free. And then I'll be using four coupons. So $1.50 off of two, $1.50 off of two, $1.50 off of two, that's three coupons, $1.50 off of two. Hold on, my brain's not working, hold on. Okay, I grabbed one too many, so I'm gonna be using four coupons, $1.50 off of two, so that's gonna be $6 off in coupons, and then two of the five off of 25 so far, and we'll go ahead and get the rest of the stuff to get to 50. All right, so far my total is $30.72. So I'm gonna do the PNG deal. I do need some laundry products, especially the gain. These are a part of a spend 20. You get $5 back. This is a limit of two. I'm only gonna do it once. They're $5.49 on most of the sale price items. I'm gonna pick up one gain detergent, one gain softener, I believe. I think that's what I was going for I don't see it though oh they moved it here we go so the gain softener 
down here. I'm going to grab one of the downy and one of the tides at 579, 549 right here. So those four items are going to get me over, I believe it's going to be about a little less than $22. So that adds to my $30.72. So that puts me over the 50 but I do have to consider I have dollar off coupons off each item. So I will have to find a filler. I'm pretty sure once I figure out all the math, I'll let you know. I also have this home mailer for $2 off of any Downy Ultra Fabric Softener liquids, although it has the softener sheets on the picture. Just so you know, these things never scan. They always have to push them through, but most cashiers will just verify I got the right product and push it through. Now this will affect my two five off of 25, so I do have to count that in. Um, so I will factor that in as well. And I do have one more of those one coupons, they're Catalina coupons. That's a dollar off of any $5 purchase of beverages. So let me pull that out and show you what that looks like because I'll be using that as well. It expired yesterday, so I'll test it out to see if it'll work. All right, so after all the coupons that will count against my threshold uh, the amount that I need to spend, my total is $45.68, so I do need four dollars and some change to make sure both of those five off of 25s work so i'm going to go ahead and pick up some more of the pure zero i know this is going to put me well over what i need but the good thing is the rebate back on ibotta makes this free so they're 6.99 you get 350 back for each one on ibotta but of course the monthly deal of buy two and you get ten dollars back that helps it and makes it free in the end. So it's worth it to me. I could put some five hour energy in there. I don't have any Revlon clearance or anything like that or the coupons. So this is the best scenario for me. All right, so I'm at 59.66 with those pure zeros. So this is real time shopping y'all. <laughs> You're coming with me as I'm figuring this out. And I just realized I have this 12 off 60. So since I'm at $59.66, I'm going to throw in something cheap, something less than a dollar, I know that, and get over the 60. I know I'll be over 60 with the CRV on the sparkling ice, but the CRV, uh, that doesn't count towards your threshold, at least in my experience, it hasn't, but I always just don't count it in because we have to pay five cents a bottle. So that would get me over the 60. But I don't want to take a chance because in my experience, it doesn't work that way. So I'm going to go ahead and find something for less than a dollar and then check out and let you guys know how it all turns out. I'm going to go ahead and get the paper because my son is in there. So I'm going to grab this and that's going to get me where I need to be. Here's a look at my receipt. I have the pure zeros here at the top. The paper was 92 cents. The downy and the $2 home mailer coupon. Now, none of my low to card coupons came off, although I was over 60 after those coupons. I was actually $60, cent $60 and some change. I did do the math over to verify. So that's something I'll have to contact customer service about. I'm not quite sure what didn't count. I'm not sure if the paper didn't count. Um, 
but even after the home mailer and that dollar off of a five dollar purchase on the beverages coupon came off I was still over 60 so I did count those in as well I'm not quite sure why that didn't work but as you saw there is a new system so I'm not sure if those are new system things going on there but it's all right I can get that fixed with customer service so I should have had a four dollars additional come off of this with the load of cards but there's my 12 off of 60 there are the sparkling waters so those are $1.79 each in my store five cent CRV I bought two got one free and you can see how it's all broken out there it's a little mumble jumbled but you get the gist of it and then um, my total was $47.03. My tax was $4.11. My goodness. And then I paid $51.14, all with bonus cash. I had like 90 something. I still have all that left. Oh my goodness, I have $45 left. Um, I had almost $100 on this account. So, and then I earned 33. And I'll show you what I earned in just a minute. And then I earned 667 points, which is a little over a dollar probably like a dollar and 18 off the top of my head but i'm not sure and then here are the two pure zeros the sparkling ices and the png so i do have tracking towards the png and then if i wanted to do it again so after getting the 33 back and then the 17 back on ibotta so it's going to be 10 for the, the big pure zero and seven for the smaller ones wherever they're at so that's 17 back from Ibotta, and with all my rewards points, it ends up being free, plus a little bit of a moneymaker, only like 15 cent moneymaker, but that's even with the $4 cup uh, load of card coupons not working. So once I get that, then I'll make that little over a $4 moneymaker, which is amazing for all of this stuff. I'm so glad to be back. I, s I really miss Rite Aid. I will come back and get some more sparkling ice because I found some on another aisle. Um, I can actually show that to you in just a minute. I'm glad I came over here to check because it's not the right size. Um, these are not a part of the deal. These are the 33.8 ounce and the ones that are a part of the deal. I don't think these ones are. Hold on. It's hard to know because they're $1.79 as well, but it says it's a one liter. So that's the one liter ones, but I don't see them tagged for the deal. So let me know if you know, but... Um, these are the only ones that are left in the store. I think there's like only a couple more of the lemonade ones, so I couldn't do that deal again. But um, if this is a part of it, then that would work. I don't know if the coupons would work on these, though. I think it did say only 17 ounces, so. Or larger. Let me check. Oh, 17 ounce bottles only. So it wouldn't work on that anyway if it was a part of the deal. So, But if you're still looking for this product, you could check to see if the one liters are a part of it. I'm not sure. The other amazing thing is I did get some coupons to work with. I don't know what's all in here, but hopefully there's something good in here. Um, but it's always good to have coupons when I can get them. So that's all I have for this video. I hope it was helpful. I hope you guys were able to get some shopping in, especially if you have bonus cash expiring like I do, then make sure you get out there and get in on some deals. All right, guys, I'll talk to you in the next one. Bye. It's 115 out here, so this is right on time. Cheers. Talk to you in the next one. Bye.